Hello, Winston, and welcome to my channel, Football Manager 2018, hot off the press. Uh, so I decided to do a few generic scenarios. Started with this one, 2017-2018 season. Um, I went on holiday for the whole season, you know, currently unemployed um, in the old job market here. So I just want to see what would happen around the leagues. And as a Blackburn Rovers fan... Most importantly, my focus of attention was going to be League One. We'll take a look at that in just a second, but let's just get stuck into it. See what Football Manager 2018 has predicted for the season. Let's kick it off with League Two. Uh, I'm trying not to reveal too much. Uh, here's the uh, statistics for you here. Uh, I am returning to the Football Manager scene after a good long 10-year absence, so navigating through this is pretty Pretty tricky. So the Sky Bet League Two is ranked 71st across Europe um, in the in the league structure. So, but this is what the uh, the program has simulated for the season. Luton coming out on winners. Coventry second. Colchester also getting promoted. Exeter through the back door of the playoffs. As at the bottom of the table, Barnet. Their time in the football league is done. Newport County also out. Let's take a look at the goal scorers. Let's get a little closer here. Danny Rose tops the charts, 24 goals for Mansfield. James Connors second, 22 goals. Luton. Stuart Bevan, third place, 21 goals. Uh, not bad for a veteran, 34 um, years of age. Who was the most creative? Uh, let's have a look if we've got assists in here. They surely should have assists. Uh, let's get back out of there. Most assists. Alex Woodyard, 14 assists for the season for Lincoln, who, according to the charts, just missed out on the uh, promotion via the playoffs. Um, and there's the result, actually. There's the result of the final. 2-1 winners. Exeter through the back door into League one. And speaking of League One, we're going to avoid that just right now. We're going to jump straight into the championship because obviously I'm a Blackburn Rovers fan trying to build up a bit of tension. But here's the Sky Bet Championship. Who will go up and who will remain? It was a tough old division according to this simulation. Reading getting through uh, as champions. 86 points. Barnsley make it to the Premier League for the first time in a long, 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 long time. And Cardiff return to the Premier League through the back door. Um, of the playoffs down at the bottom well in real world Sheffield United has exploded onto the scene as have Bristol, Bristol City not in Forest not doing too bad themselves but the simulation here has them doomed for relegation as for the top goal scorers let's get a little closer look here Steve Morrison 20 goals not bad for a 40 year old Burton's Lucas Axon sorry Burton's Lucas Atkins, second, with 19 goals. Tom Bradshaw in there, third spot, 18 goals. Most assists, Ruben Neves, 21-year-old. He's got 14 assists for the season. Quality player, we all know that. 13.75 million. He's on funny money for the championship. Um, but yeah, that's the that's a quick summary of the championship. So Barnsley, on, on this simulation, will be playing Premier League football, as will Reading. Uh, speaking of Premier League football, let's take a sneak peek and see what happened there. Chelsea defied the odds. When you compare that to current, the current state of play in the real world, um, yeah, it's a bit of a bit of a shocker. Let's have a quick glance over there. The top six have been disrupted by Southampton, squeaking ahead of Liverpool. That might, that'll make Saints fans happy over recent. But uh, sixth spot for them, Chelsea champions, Arsenal in second spot, Man City third, United fourth. Down the bottom end, no major surprises. Where are them scumbags? Them scumbags held on by the skin of their teeth. 35 points. They will be playing Premier League football for another season. Swansea, on the other hand, Brighton and Huddersfield, they return to League well, Championship. As for the top of the pops, goal scorers. In fact, I'm on uh, assists right now. Let's go to the goals. Javier Hernandez, 30 years old, 20 goals. Harry Kane, that's more like it. That's a true to life statistic. 20 goals for him, youngster. Uh, knocking on the door there. Alex Sanchez, 19 goals. Romelu Kaka. Let's have a look at his transfer situation, see if that got rectified. Um, doesn't look like it. Looks like he's he's valued at 3.4 million. He's, he's on his way out. He ain't sticking around. 
Um, also assists Kevin De Bruyne at top of the pops, 15 assists for the season. Juan Mata second. So let's go into the one that matters, and you can, if you're quick enough, you can see the uh, winners. Of course, this I had no influence in this whatsoever. Blackburn Rovers, 88 points as champions. Oxford sneak in the, in the second spot. And Rotherham through the back door of the playoffs. 75 points. Where are them? Shrewsbury fellas. Down in 15th spot. So their start to the season has uh, faded dramatically. And Wigan. Oh, poor soppy season there. Ninth spot. As for goals, let's have a look at the goal scoring charts. Again, wrong one there. Two Gillingham players top the... Top the goal scoring charts. 24, 25 goals for Joel Asoro. 22 goals for Mason Bennett. Paddy Madden in there with uh, 20 goals. Uh, not a top. There is not a Blackburn player in the top top 10. I need to have to investigate that a little situ situation. As for assists, John Taylor tops the joint top with Elliot Bennett of Rovers. 15 assists. So let's get a closer look at Blackburn. Where did the goals come from? Um... See if we can take a look. All attempts. Yeah, not really. Not not an impressive uh, season on the goal scoring charts. In fact, they're spread around a little bit. Joe Rankin Costello got himself three goals for the season. Dominic Samuel only six. Uh, Danny Graham with ten. Bradley Dack the most impressive there. So that's that's a, a quick summary of the leagues. Let's have a look at the FA Cup. In fact, let's take a look at the, the Mickey Mouse Cup, the Checker Trade Cup. Um, and it's uh, Rotherham. Rotherham beating Tottenham under 23s in the final. Not sure where Blackburn ended up. That cup ranks 60th uh, amongst other cups. Meanwhile, let's take a look at the, the next Mickey Mouse Cup, the Carabao Cup. Southampton looked like they had a decent season all round. 2-0 winners over Everton in the final. Uh, and the FA Cup, West Ham winners over Manchester United. That's uh, I'm sure they, they would accept that. Um, but that's it. I'm not going to dig into the Euro Leagues anymore. That's just a quick summary of what my football manager 2018 has predicted for the season. I'm not. I'm not saying that Rovers are going to walk it. You know, as a Rovers fan, the machine has told you. The machine has spoken. So live and die by that. Anyway, until next time, thumbs up, subscribe. Ciao for now. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Check back for more FM content over the next few days. As for my Rovers fans, fear not, Blackburn Rovers content will always be my number one. So don't you go anywhere. Anyway, let's head back into the dugout for some more FM action.